is going on and welcome back to another video in this video i'm gonna be talking about whether we will have game 163s and yes with an s or not so the potential game 163 matchups could be dodgers and rockies or brewers and cubs both to see whether they could be first all both games whether uh, those two teams could see they could be the first place team or not so first off with the dodgers and the giants it used to be walker bueller versus um andy soares that was the matchup now it's rich hill and i believe they did that because uh i think if the dodgers are preparing uh for a scenario if there's the game 163 that they'll start walker bueller which is a pretty good matchup i don't know who the rockies would put i don't know um if freeland could pitch i'm not sure how many games ago he pitched but yeah, so the Giants, their job, um, well, they put up a fight the first two games, I'll be honest. Yesterday, they put up five runs against Clayton Kershaw. Five runs. I mean, I don't know when's the last time Kershaw gave up anything more than three. Um, after the All-Star game, he had been lights out. So uh, as a Giants fan, I'm very proud for what they did, even though they gave up a ton of runs. Um, and then the next game uh, for the NL West team are the Rockies and the Nats. Uh, the Nats, everyone was saying that Max Scherzer could have a shot. It's actually, I'm not I'm not sure how you pronounce his name. It's Feedy. Some people call him Fide. I'm pretty sure it's Feedy, but he's going to be going up against Tyler Anderson. Um, and in this game, I think that the Rockies will win. So um, Tyler Anderson has been struggling a ton lately. He did go through a phase where he was lights out, but recently has been str struggling a lot. That Nats lineup is very good. But I think the Rockies is just better, and that's going to be a hitting game right there. Um, so, yeah. And in this game, I think the Giants, uh, you know, they've won their last game of the season two straight years. And I, I think that they're really going to uh, put up a fight like they did in the first two games. And they really want to pull the Dodgers down. So, it's your job, especially when you're facing your rival even more. And then the next, um, and then the, for the NL Central, we've got the Cardinals and Cubs. Uh, Cardinals got eliminated yesterday, so they don't have a shot. But they've got Flaherty, and the Cubs have Montgomery. So this is going to be interesting. Uh, Montgomery has been decent, nothing special. He's just been decent. Um, and then Flaherty with a 3.16 ERA. It's going to be a close one. But I think that the Brewers will win for sure. Gio Gonzalez has been struggling, but they're going up against uh, Turnbull, I believe that is how you pronounce his name. Uh, so... The Brewers, I think their hitting is just too good. I believe they're going to win this game. So if the Cubs uh, want to have a chance to win the division, they have to win today. Um, obviously, every team does. But in this case, I really think the Brewers um, are looking good uh, to win the division. For the NL West, I am not sure. But I think we're at least going to have one uh, game 163. I don't think... I mean... And I think if we do have the game 163, it'll be for the NL Central. Um, unless the Dodgers win. I think the Rockies are winning for sure. I think the Brewers are winning for sure. The Cubs and the Dodgers, I'm not sure of. So make sure you guys leave your um, predictions down in the comments below. I'm, I know I'm making this a little less than an hour before the game start, but... Um, if you guys watch it before the game, make sure to make a legit prediction and uh, make sure to drop a like. I remember the baseball season starting just like yesterday, but a lot of horrible things happened throughout the year. So, you know, I, at the end of the day, I guess I'm kind of happy that it's ending because the Giants could rest with all these injuries and um, hopefully come out strong next year. Pick up a bat or two and have a healthy team, stay healthy and get better. So that's our goal for next year. And um, yeah, guys, so make sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you are new or one sub away from 140. Remember, my goal is every five subs. So 140 will be the next goal to achieve. So hopefully you guys can get that done. And I will see you all next time.